All right, welcome back to Dark Souls. Today, we are going to finally go into the depths. Something I've been putting off for a while because I keep finding shit to do. Um, off camera, I think I might have jumped a little bit. Off camera, I was actually doing a little bit of weapon leveling to get my Zweehander to plus five. And I will show you that here in a second, just for, for the goods. Is it there? Plus five sweet hander. I've done that for a specific reason. Um, we are going to be upgrading that sweet hander to do divine damage, but it's going to be a little while before I can actually do that. Um, and as it turns out, the item I need in order to upgrade it to divine is in the depths, so we'll have to do that anyway. Either way. She's really quiet, but the game's really loud, so I don't know what the hell's... Okay, whatever. Uh, we'll need those later, not right now. She's got humanity. I'm gonna have to come back for those. She's got 11 of them, shit. Um, we need this, though. Blooming purple, blooming purple moss clumps. We need all of those. I'm probably going to make another trip and get more of them. They're very useful for where we're going. Not immediately, but I need to at least be conscious of the fact that I probably should be buying them. Ooh, creepy. I'm all creeped out already. This place in the game really does give me vibes. Well, if they didn't know we were here before, they certainly do now. After I've crashed into like 10 million barrels. Now, that guy down there is a new enemy. And yes, it is a butcher a la Silent Hill. Looks very silent hilly. Let's see if we can get his attention from up here. Yep, there he comes. I'd rather fight him up here to be honest. I would not want to fight him down there. Actually, I think it's a lady. Someone told me it was a lady. I think it was Voldex. Wow. That butcher is in a hurry to get to us. Oh dear! Hit slightly harder than I remember. Ah! But, no match for our trusty Black Knight Halberd. Sad to say. It'll be a while before I run up against anything that I'm actually terrified by using this thing. I'm not even sure if the next boss is going to be difficult. Next boss is actually another one that I've just never died to, or thought about dying to. So I might be a little bit, uh, what's the word? Loose, maybe. I think that might be right. Okay. Doggy be dead. Doggy be dead. Hmm. Let's take a sip of Vestas. Large ember. Oh boy, another ember for things. I don't remember who we give that one to. I think it might be Andre again. But I don't recall completely, so uh, I'm not sure. Now, down there, 
we actually need to put an item on for this. As that muck is poor footing, quote unquote. And we went to the Undead Asylum specifically to get the ring in order to be able to deal with this. Normally, down here, we would have trouble moving around. However, because we came prepared, that will not be an issue. So we can explore down here to our heart's content, basically. If there's anything actually down here, I'm not sure if there is. I thought there was something. Mm, oh, 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 maybe this is it. Must help me. Okay. There you go, buddy. Thank you. I would have been a sucker without you. Been in the line. I shut up. Thank you. Thank you. Thank you, dearly. I am Luetius. For the great swamp. I will not forget my death. Okay. Thanks, buddy. Oh, hello. So he's um, our pyromancer friend, and he will go back to the shrine now, and when we meet back up with him later, he will teach us pyromancies. Nice fellow. It is commonly incorrectly done um, that people will try to break open his box with a weapon instead of just rolling, and uh, that makes him mad at you so be sure not to do that that's a very bad thing to do I'm trying to free NPCs from barrels by attacking them that upsets them greatly oh another one what the hell I didn't see a second one hi lady poke the one-handed attack seems to do enough damage now that I could feasibly just keep the shield out and not worry about it. I'll pretty much go two-handed for bosses, usually, unless the one-handed moveset is really wonky. Okay. But honestly, this moveset is not that bad. It really isn't. I can see myself using this through the rest of the game with no problem. Alright, we've been here. Let's see where we need to go next. Uh, hmm. This place is a bit of a maze. I might frequently wander around in circles just because I'm not totally sure where to go. Oh, here we go. That looks right. Uh, or maybe it wasn't. No, no, I think this is good. This is one way to get down. <laughs> Forgot about you, rat. <laughs> Giant rat. I kind of want to do a jumping attack on it. Giant rat jumping attack! Well, that was terrifying. But we killed it, so hey. Now we are in what I like to call the depths proper, I think. And there is a lot of cool shit down here. The only problem is we have to be very careful about where we're going. We have to watch our step. Because if we don't, bad things will happen to us. I mean, we do have 9 Estus Flasks, so I'm not super worried about anything, but hey. Let's let that poison fade down for a second. I need Keybind, uh, shit. Oh, okay, I've already got it. I need Keybind my other one, though. Yeah, there we go. Okay. Aww. Let's not go that way just yet. Bunch of mice over there. Hi, mousies. 
Oh, oh geez. Oh geez. Okay, back up. Mousy's in a sorcerer. I heard that noise. Yeah, we'll need to take him out. Ooh, shit. Ah! Ooh! Oh god! Oh god! Oh god! Oh god! Mouse hurts! Mouse hurts! Mouse hurts! Fuck! Fuck! Ah! Damn it! I got moused! Mouse to the face! It did way more damage than I was expecting. <laughs> oh god. Okay. Well, let's make the trip back. Didn't lose too many souls, but shit. Oh, is the is the pyromancer guy here? Hang on. He should be here. I think he moved. Uh, maybe not yet. Okay, we'll come back and check on him.